Hi guys, this is Jason on the comment. I'm here with the Huawei Honor 6 Plus. Not very long ago, a few weeks ago, we unboxed and reviewed the Huawei Honor 6 and today we're unboxing the Huawei Honor 6 Plus. It's basically the bigger version of the Honor 6. Okay, so this is the device we're dealing with. It's a tablet. I'll tell you that from the start. It was launched at the end of 2014 and it's a Full HD tablet with an identical box compared to the Huawei Honor 6. It's blue, it doesn't have many brandings and the price tag for this model is $450. However, from what I've heard, there is a 3G only version that's selling for around $320, which is a good deal. So let's see what is inside this box right here. So let's try and remove this smaller box inside the blue box and inside we find a big charger hopefully with some quick charging technologies and then the usb cable nothing else here no trace of headphones if i'm not mistaken the huawei under 6 also didn't have headphones okay let's also open up this box we got this metal key here that allows us to access these sim slots there are two of them on this device as far as we know you can see them right here and inside the box we probably have a ton of manuals aside from manuals we also have these protective uh, layers to apply on the screen and on the back side okay enough about this it's time for the setup so this is the huawei honor 6 plus it has a glass back and a glass front and let's press the on off button on the side and see what the uh, interface is like this model stands out through a unique feature, it has a dual camera setup at the back, these are two 8 megapixel shooters that are placed right there and they are basically ultra pixel cameras because their pixels measure 1.98 microns. Speaking of measurements, this phone measures 7.5 millimeters in thickness and it weighs 165 grams so it's quite heavy. The screen you're seeing right here is a 5.5 incher, an IPS LCD with a full HD resolution. So setup has started. We're continuing the setup, agreeing to the terms. And that was a very fast setup. What you're seeing right here is Emotion UI 3.0 applied on top of Android 4.4 KitKat. We're familiar with Emotion UI because you also saw it on Huawei Honor 6 and I have to admit we quite liked it when we reviewed that device. It's very minimalistic, it has a pretty nice um, quick, quick settings area and settings area. And speaking of minimalistic, the camera UI is very similar to the one in iOS, which is a compliment. Back to the specifications, this device will offer you dual SIM slots and the processor inside, well, that one is a high silicon Kirin 925, an octa-core unit. There is also 3 gigabytes of RAM, 16GB of storage or 32GB as well as a micro SD card slot from what we know. And now the cameras, we got an 8 megapixel selfie shooter and also we got dual 8 megapixel cameras and a dual LED flash next to them. There's LTE connectivity on the LTE model of course and the battery, well the battery is a 3600 mAh unit. As you can see, all the applications on this device are placed on the home screens. There is no separate area for apps. We got a bunch of folders, we got productivity apps, we got Kings of Office, some games included, some tools, and there's even a special folder for the Google apps that are available on this model. Pretty fluid interface applied on top of KitKat. I must also mention that we're getting infrared connectivity here. This is the infrared emitter, so you can use the phone as your TV remote. Other stuff for mentioning, well, I guess it's time to have a look at the camera UI that I recently compared to the UI of the iPhone. So it's very simple and minimalistic, it reminds me of iOS, everything is black and white. This is the settings area, that's only portrait oriented, just like on the Huawei Honor 6. Okay, so those are the first impressions and the unboxing of the Huawei Honor 6 Plus. As far as we know, $320 for the 3G version, the LTE version a bit more, around $450. We got a unique interface applied on top of KitKat. We got a unique camera setup with dual ultra pixel cameras at the back that I'm looking forward to test because it offers refocus and all that. Aside from the glass back and glass front, as far as I can feel, 
this should be metal on the sides but I've confirmed that in the full review. This is gsnl.com, hope you like the unboxing of the Huawei Honor 6 Plus, we'll be back with the full review very soon, bye bye.